Greetings. I'm a dragon alchemist, and allow me to entertain you. I'm playing Fallout 4, where I, after some inventory management, went into Sanctuary and uh, dumped a lot of stuff, I came back to Diamond City to get some quests done. Because apparently, there's quite a few still around here. Ever been up in the stands? Let's just say they. I mean, I just noticed that there's a lot of side quests in Diamond City, and I might as well just get them out of the way. Should stop by Fallon's basement. Open during the day. Yeah, I don't need new clothes. Oh, here we go. Try it, you feel. All right, you. Tell me. Diamond City Radio is terrible, yes? It makes you want to cut your own ears off. Not that bad, but uh, what is the issue? So, what's the issue? Have you not listened? This DJ Travis, he's terrible. It makes <laughs> me want to go back in time and prevent radio from ever being invented. But, Tim, it's true. Don't listen to my brother. Someone needs to get rid of him. We need a new DJ for the radio. I don't think many would notice if he, you know, disappeared. Are you asking for a Juanito from Tropico? Uh, yeah, subtle reference for those that uh, have played the series, but horrible That's idea. A horrible horrible. idea. I tell you, it would be easier than you think. You just have to talk to. You just have to talk him into following you out of town. Honestly, oh, right. Vadim, That's what the enough. hell has gotten into you? Vadim isn't serious. He doesn't really want to kill Travis. Yeah, what's really going on here? Okay, what's really going on here? <laughs> Sorry, we were just joking around a bit. <laughs> it, it's true. Only jokes. Travis is a good friend. If him and I worry about him. Well, Travis... He, he means well, but he does not have the confidence he needs for that job, or anything else, really. And so he's always awkward. He does not believe in himself, you see? He expects he will fail at everything, and so he does. Yeah, that's tough to change. Well, something like that could be tough to change. No, it's easy to fix. I tell you, Fim, over and over. Go on, spoil sport. Go back to working. We will figure out how to help Travis. Come, you. Meet me in back room. We discuss plan. Uh huh. So apparently. Hey, you're, you're that vault dweller. You joke about people about killing them. Yeah, that's nice. Could have gone with another line of thought, because that sounded pretty bloody serious for a moment. You converted a shower okay. into a Let us get kitchen. down to brass tacks. I am glad you are willing to help. Unlike my deadbeat brother. Travis is a good guy. He deserves better life. Well, well, I'm waiting for the idea. I haven't agreed to help yet, but I'm waiting for the idea. I haven't actually heard the radio yet because, you know, copyright and all that. Well, yeah. I'm just waiting to hear your idea. Travis needs boost of confidence. You know what does that for him? Winning a bar fight. I'm sure you've been in one, yes? Um... Me personally, never been in a bar fight. This guy, though, being in the military... Don't quite know, but he has been in a fight. That's for sure. I can hold my own, if that's what you mean. This one's a pretty tough cookie. Exactly what I mean. I want you to back up Travis in his first fight. I want to stage fight here in Dugga. Nothing too serious. Uh, we make sure Travis wins and feels good about himself after. I want you to be there to help make it look real. What do you think? Sound good to you? Well, uh, how does that work? Because winning a bar fight, I don't quite know boosts confidence. I mean, it's uh, maybe for a bit, but that could backfire big time. How would something like that even work? It makes sense, I promise. I have contacts, people I can count on. Real top looking. But they will take a dive for money. They confront Travis here at Dugga. 
you step in and give him who she needs to stand up to them. Then you and Travis take them down. Nothing gets too rough. And Travis is something he can feel good about. Simple, right? Well, why involve me? I mean, I'm agreeing to this because, well, it's a quest and it's interesting, so... Why involve me in this? You have seen Travis, yes? <laughs> he cannot fight alone. Not even fake one. He needs That's help. That's not quite what I you meant. You can help. Yeah, it's too late today for me to arrange. You come back tomorrow evening after six o'clock and everything will be ready. Uh huh. Yeah, so staging a fight so someone can win. You How much is that worth in caps? Stop by the mega surgery sometime. Yeah, no, thank you. That said, if I actually had money for some kind of modifications to my face in real life, there's a few things I'd like to change, but just minor things. Nothing like bone structure or anything like that. I mean, we all both got those little uh, facial uh, things that we really like to change, but I just don't uh, see it going that far. This home plate requires key. only opens with a key. And there's a power armor station. Someone's living here that has power armor. Well, I suppose they all need protection. Well, no one's actually got power stored there. Well, power, uh, power armor, I meant. All right, all right. What's what else is on the map? See Abbott about the wall, which is the other way. So let's see what this is about. Too late for the the fight. So let's see about the wall. Is that the mayor? What is he doing up there? Piper's gonna get a lot out of this one. Uh, I'll get to you in a second. What are you doing here? Everybody! Everybody! I need everyone's attention. I would like to address the subject that is on everyone's mind. And that is the disgusting article Piper has written. Diamond City has stood united for over 150 years. And what keeps us united are two things. First, is the great green guardian behind me, the wall, our protector and our savior from the filth of the outside. And second, is our faith and trust in each other, the faith and trust that has given us prosperity, security, and education for every citizen. And while the paper might point their fingers at synths and other ghost stories to drive us apart, we will not betray this sacred trust. Now, I want everyone to hear these next words very carefully. I am not a synth. I am the same flesh and blood boy who grew up on these streets, who was born in a shack just down the waterfront to Martha and Patrick McDonough. And I will not abandon my city. <laughs> was that a heinous allegations of the press. Was that a Bioshock God reference? bless this city. God bless the wall. Piece of shit. <laughs> well, that's politics for you. Gotta make those speeches. Gotta stay in office. Yeah, and well, it's nice being all unified and all that. I can get behind that. Lou, can I get a minute? Something I need to do. Since are out there. Hey. What can I do? Yeah, talk. Piper. Hey, here. Something to keep you sharp. Always worked for me. Bubblegum? Okay, yeah. Your, Your thoughts? thoughts? Never thought a reporter could consider themselves a success until someone threatened their life. Me? I'm very successful. Uh-huh. I just wanted to check in, make sure things were all right between us. I suppose things are all right. Just feels like we could be doing more for folks out here, you know? Yeah, that's fine. Oh, nothing. Okay. I thought you needed to do something. What was that about? Piper, what are you doing? I was 
I would have thought you would have had something to say about that speech. You would think so. Don't touch the paint. Wasn't intending to. Don't worry, I won't. It's okay, Abbott. I got my eye on this one. Good. The wall keeps out the bad guys, so I appreciate you not messing her up none. Thinking you need a little education. Maybe a bit of community service. What do you say? Uh, yeah, what is this about? Because I don't do jobs without knowing the details. What do you need done? You see this paint I'm using? Only one place left in the whole Commonwealth you can get it. Hardware Town. Rune store close by to the west. Bring back a can of paint, and it'll be a hundred caps in your pocket. How's that sound? Uh... Can I get a location? An exact location? You gotta put it on my map? What can you tell me about Hardware Town? Raiders moved in a ways back. Security says they can't handle them. That's why I'm running low. So, you still up for it? And you think I can? Well, you'd be right! Paint retrieval. I'm on it. Much obliged. Always on good behavior, aren't you? <laughs> well, I try to be. I try to be. Seems like you're doing better than trying. I appreciate it. Too few folks can be bothered. Of course, in my experience, if you want to do real good, playing nice only gets you so far. I mean, look at Diamond City. A place I've been trying to warn of real danger. But every issue I publish, all I hear is, Oh, Piper, why don't you ever publish anything happy? Piper, why can't you write something nice for a change? It's enough to make me want to hang up my hat some days. Well, I know there's dangers. So I don't need to ask that question. But at the same time, I do understand what people are talking about. It's not always have to be doom and gloom. You can go a little bit on nice things that have happened. You don't have hey, to do sti still silly that? little uh, kinch stories, but just something that's good and relevant. But it must be exhausting. Sounds I'll, like I it will must say be that. exhausting. Huh, no kidding. But people, they deserve to know the truth. Sure, it can be scary knowing what's really out there. <laughs> the night doesn't go by, I'm not afraid. Some institute drone will decide today's the day to pay old Piper and family a visit. But it's worth it. Because I know the truth. That's what protects us. And a lot of firepower. Yeah, but you do need to know the truth. You don't know what you're fighting against, that's going to be hard to fight back. Absolutely. Couldn't agree more. How can you protect you and yours if you don't know what you're facing? Exactly. Most folks, though, they'd prefer a comforting lie. Not me. I've seen firsthand what the truth can do. My sister and I... We grew up way out in the Commonwealth. Tiny little settlement. Our dad, he was part of the local militia. <laughs> Keeping the raiders off our backs and the Mirelurks out of our latrines, as he'd describe it. Well, uh, one day, our dad turns up dead. His captain, asshole named Mayburn, claims raiders must have gotten him on watch. Well, I didn't buy it. I start making inquiries. Turns out, the captain, he'd sold out. Thought he wasn't getting paid enough to babysit the town. He was gonna leave the gates open one night. Let a group of raiders sack the place and take a cut of the profits. My dad found out and was gonna turn Mayburn in, but Mayburn got to him first. And I wasn't about to let that bastard get away with murder. I tried talking to the mayor, but he wouldn't listen. So... I papered the entire town in posters. Wanted for gross dereliction of duty, Captain Mayburn. The mayor sure wanted to talk after that. <laughs> the town threw Mayburn out on his ass and were dug in when a very surprised group of raiders finally showed. Ooh, dead father that was murdered by his superior. I can see how things go from there. Except she kind of put on a journalism hat and uh, her red trench coat rather than putting out a pair of bat ears. I feel like I'm talking to myself here. Yeah, I'm sorry about your dad. Thanks. It was hard after he was gone, but knowing that he died doing right, that's always made it easier. But hey, I, I'm sorry if I've been rambling. I just get fired up sometimes. It's just nice to talk to someone who 
who actually seems to get it, you know? So, should we head out? Yeah. Well, what we're going to be doing next isn't exactly the most interesting of things. We're going out to <laughs> find some paint, because it's really close by. And since it's really close by, I may as well get it done. I mean, the caps aren't all that interesting. I can get caps easy. I don't even buy that much. But the... It's a quest. A quest dish out lots of experience points compared to what I normally receive from just killing things. And he said raiders. So... Yeah, doing the community a bit of a service here by getting rid of a threat. Now, could I talk them down? Perhaps. Do I have the charisma to do it? Maybe. Will they actually be interested? Highly doubtful. No, 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 no. I thought I turned off the radio. Or do those iBots not count for radio? Yeah, I, I did. Those I iBots. fancy vault suits. Those one size fit all? I would think so. Now, let's check the map. Okay, I'm heading the wrong way, apparently. This way. Why isn't it displaying? Apparently, oh yeah. Painting the town. There we go. That's the right way. You never know if you can talk things out, but, uh. Oh, hello. Yeah, get rid of the high priority target first. Hey, how about channeling that anger somewhere else, huh? Can I bats this thing? Yeah, I can bats this thing easy. Build up a crit me. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh, more of them. More of them. Ooh, nice mid-air lunge. Wait. I'm hearing a voice. Oh, well, there's Hardware Town. Oh, well, Settler needs help, apparently. Oh, or I would if I could get inside. Okay, okay. Wait for it to finish opening and closing, then use it. Hate that bug. She's right back here. Hurry. All right. So apparently the raiders have taken another victim. Yeah. Can you not be so blatant about it? I'd rather have some bit of stealth as I no, I don't come like in. This. Yeah, I don't hey, like this either. I told you to bring them in through the basement. Shut up. They're headed this way now. Be ready. Well, apparently she was a plant. Go figure. I figured she was a little too brazen about going in. Well, since they know we're coming... Let's not go in through the way that the, uh... What is taking so long? I don't know. What the hell was that? Yeah, let's not go in through that way, shall we? I'd prefer not... Oh wait, this is the basement. Let's not go in through the basement. They want me to go through the basement. That means they've got something trapped there too. So two ways that don't. Oh, hey, oh. Man. grenade out! Stem pack in. Oh. Oh no. Okay. That went badly for me. That was embarrassing. That was extremely embarrassing. <sighs> but Piper blocks my shots. Oh, I don't like this. Yeah, I kind of realized that. Hey! I told you to bring them in through the basement. Shut up! They're headed this way now. Be ready. Okay, let's try this without getting rushed and without Piper kind of a. Uh... Blocking my shots. All right, grenade out. There you are, you little Blue, we're not alone. All right, whoever's coming through this door is getting a bunch of double O A. Butch. 
shot to the face. That did indeed. Fusion cells, nice. Is that the last of their ambush? Hello, Raider scumbag. Yeah, that grenade didn't go as well as I'd like. Oh well. At least I got some shot sh shotgun shells back from that. And then a sim pack. Nice. Well, now that this place is dealt with... Okay, apparently my quest objective is right across the way. How convenient. Well... The toaster. Pickled watch in the dryer. Who puts that stuff in there? Okay, there's blue paint, and there's yellow paint, and there's no green paint. Not finding anything in here. Well, apparently... If you've ever done any actual painting, you use a paint mixer. Thank you. I have actually taken some art classes before. I actually know how to do a little bit of painting. I do- I can produce some nice quality stuff. The thing is, it takes me a while. It takes me a long while to get anything done to my satisfaction. Yeah, well. And then there's some pieces that I just do not do well. I have done some pretty awful pieces. Oh, pins. Oil can. Why do I need oil? I mean, it says it's used, but apparently it still has some in there for some reason. Scraping out the bottom of the barrel. Yeah, apparently there's a way up here. Wonder glue. Gotta take wonder glue. Because while I'm not using many resources now, when I finally do, it's like going on a binge. I just store it all up, and away it goes. It just goes away fast. All those resources. Fusion cores. I recall my previous statement about wanting to bring power armor out. Why did I not do that? I have power armor for a long... <laughs> what am I saying? Okay. Apparently I just had a bit of a brain fart there. Yes, I have power armor that I could use in the event that I ran across something really dangerous. These raiders. Well, somewhat dangerous, they don't really warrant power armor usage. Well, might as well just keep looting this place. Desk fang, storage key, Hell yeah. magazine. You are now able to build a high-tech light at settlement workshops. How nice. I don't really know if I should use it quite yet. Strengthened oiloid metal left arm. Left arm, left arm. Do I have anything for my 10-5? Well, this is... Well, uh, six. Oh boy. Me? Is it's a tiny bit heavier, but I prefer survivability. They really do. That incident back there proved very true for that. Forty-four rounds. Forty-four rounds. And a snub nose. Forty-four pistol. Nice. I prefer my 10 millimeter though. I like it being silenced. And there's the key for the. There's the door that the key was for. Mentats and stuff. Don't use it, but I sell it off. 308 rounds. Glowing, powerful hunting rifle. What's my... yeah, it's... it's the same power, but this one's lower quality. I think the bottle cap might, though. Loctite. Ah, I... I really should have used my perk for my last level up to get my... 
ability to open locks a little bit higher. But I wanted to start doing stuff for my settlement. Uh, yeah. Sorry, folks, but apparently the interluder in me just wants to get inside locked objects. Copper? I mean, copper's really useful for really anything, really. Duct tape and fuse. Yeah, and there's all the dead bodies I noticed earlier. All the poor saps that got ambushed. If you need anything proofread. I think I've cleared the place out, though, except... Oh, hello, what was back here? Blast radius and anti-freeze. Anti Rather nice. All right, Abbott, I got your green paint, and I cleared out the raiders. Good all around. Clap 56. Yeah, take anything that's lightweight. Ooh, gas canister. Gotta take the gas canister. Coffee cups for the ceramics. I don't know about the coffee pot. Oh, I'll take it anyway. I've got the room. And I've got Piper. Piper can always take a little extra more. Economy render glue. Always interesting. Ashtray for ceramics. More desk fans. More coffee cups. Industrial solvent. Okay. I think I have cleared the place out. At least I think I did. Well, except for that, of course, it, it's a, of the master level safe. That's a huge disappointment. Plungers, plungers. Rubber. More desk bands. Yeah, this place. This place is nice. This is a good place to get a lot of stuff. I mean, after I'm done here, this place is just going to be empty. Oh. Is this empty, or is it... Yeah, it's empty. It's just plastic. And I could get... And I could carry more plastic with a... Ooh. That's 50... Yeah. I'm tempted to take the weights, but the thing is... They do weigh exactly what they say. Yeah. Why want to take... Weights. They're made of lead. Lead is not exactly common. You you would need to find pencils for lead, and for some odd reason, pencils are hard to find around here. And why I would want lead? Ammunition. I always need that ammunition. Back to Diamond City, I go. That was a short, easy quest. Easy, although I had to die once because Piper keeps blocking my shots. But, uh, th that is one of the things I want modded in. Or at least patched up. I mean, I would appreciate Bethesda patching up the, their AI a bit. But, failing that... I know the mod community is really strong for Fallout. I would appreciate them modding in smarter AI. AI that realizes I'm aiming down sights. You do not cross a firing line. You, Someone has their sights trained on an area. You do not waltz across it and just get shot in the back. That is no good. All right, Abbott. I kind of got turned around for a second. Still painting? Or you're done? Okay. You're back. You find that paint? Yes, I did. Wasn't easy, but I found some. Yeah. Now that's damn fine news. Why don't you go ahead and paint the first stroke? Let's see how the shade matches up. Okay, I don't know about shade. Use the green paint. It's a little deeper green compared to the wall. 
It might just be texture, but it's... Hmm. Actually, it might be due to fading if I look at it. Because he, he, the paint he's using, it's almost the same shade. That's a good shade of green. The wall sure seems happy with it. Alright, happy to help. Happy to help. It's been an honor. It's nice to work with someone who knows how to show respect. There's your payment, and a little bonus for getting the right shade of green. Don't do anything with it I wouldn't do. I'm glad we did this. The wall is important to a lot of people here, Blue. Well, 200 caps rather than 100. Excellent. Not a bad payday. And how in the world did you talk to me from all the way across there? Where'd you get that drink? You know what? Never mind. After that, we kind of raiders. I could do use with the drink. Well, with that, I think we're gonna bring this episode to a close. I hope I've entertained you. Farewell.